in any other place, like if as an organization, you know, okay, well, we're we're abandoning in this route and going another, well, it just gets lost. It's amazing how much they documented. Enormous amounts of detail about the work that had been accomplished and how they had developed the technology. They were written to very high scientific standards that we can go back and do once again, or repeat once again, things that were initially studied back in the 1960s and 1970s. Now, you were aware of the molten salt reactor experiment. There were some journal articles that gave basic background. They had a full issue of a pretty substantial nuclear engineering journal. But the thing that was missing was this extensive compendium of 100-page reports that gave enormous amounts of detail about the work that had been accomplished and how they had developed the technology. And using that, we were able to accelerate our work in looking at how to develop fluoride salt cooled high temperature reactors, a variant of the earlier molten salt reactor technology.